is the energy vibration reading for the Virgos for the month of uh, um, January to 2020. Happy New Year, Virgos. Let's see what's coming up for you, Virgos. Please remember, um, in order to get the extended of these reading, you have to become a member on my channel. You'll link there or here, there, up there. Subscribe, subscribe. Go check out the monthly, the year reading and the quarterly reading so you know what's coming up in January and February. The quarterly reading, the extended are there under the super abundant. So whatever is happening and transpire under the super abundant is where you can find the general energies of the reading. Okay, so whatever the issues and the situation, go check it out. Okay, Virgos, Virgos, Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun. We're calling up on the angels and guides. Okay, Virgos, let's see what's coming out. This month has five weeks. It is the energy of emotional, the hermit. All right, Virgos, so I see you're having inner strength. You're trying to find inner strength in the first week. So whatever is transpiring with you, Virgos, inner strength is what is coming up. Now, this is a fire energy, okay? This is a fire energy that is coming up. So you're leaving this here. You're trying to find inner strength. In the second week, you have an issue that you're dealing with um, people in institutes or organization. This could be on the work floor. Some of you are back to work, but it's an earth energy. Uh, it's a fire energy. So you have two fire energy Virgos that you're dealing with people in power. It could be on the work floor. Whatever is transpire is that you're dealing with people and secrets you're dealing with people in power and the secrets that they carry and the secrets that they have whatever is transpiring the secrets could be coming out in the third week and it's about the um your your materialistic stability your materialistic world okay i see that the fourth week is going to be your best week you virgos and then the fifth week is going to another uh, be another uh, week where the energy of the star comes out so Whatever the issue and the, the 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 issue is that is transpiring, I see that some of you are dealing with um the lovers, the energy of the lovers. It could be a partner, it could be people um, you're married to, people you're in relationship with. But the there is a fire sign. The two last week, because in the third week, some secrets is going to come out, and the two last week is where. You have this balance that is happening, okay? The two last week. So I see the energy of the strength with the emperor and the deceptiveness, lies and deceptiveness that has come out. And that is going to be happening in the second week. Lies and deceptiveness because it's the seven of swords in the reverse over lies and deceptiveness with people in power. Very, very deceptiveness, okay? And it has to do with a young, with you you um um virgos um and finding out of someone in power who have used uh, um their lies and deceptiveness in a situation and the queen of swords whoever the queen of swords is could be a lawyer um where it could be a taurus virgo or a capricorn lawyer the secrets and the lies and deceptiveness of this person this situation i see you're going to make a decision what you're going to be doing whether or not you are going to be taking this person down or what you're going to be doing because I see that some of you, it could be a Capricorn that you're dealing with, but I see um, you're going to be helping this Capricorn or this Capricorn is going to be helping you. But some of you um, young people are dealing with a deceptive situation. It could be your mom, secrets about your mom and something that has transpired, okay? So if your mom is an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra woman, there is secrets about your mom. I see burdens that you're carrying, and it has to do with some deceptiveness, especially you young men between the age of 18 and 45. You're dealing with some burdens that you're carrying, and it has to do with some deceptiveness, dealing with people in power and people who have used their power. I see the energy of the Four of Pentacles, so I see this is... A, your financial stability, brilliant, your financial stability, lies and deceptiveness, secrets about an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra and someone um, and your lawyer. So if you have a lawyer, um, some secrets about the lies and deceptiveness of your lawyer. 
the four of cups is here looks and abundance is going to be coming in the third week so you could find out something and they have to keep it's like they're paying you to shut your mouth so take the money walk away from them you're gonna be celebrating overcoming a deceptive situation especially you young people between the age of 18 and 45 you found out some lies and deceptiveness about people in power and the secrets that they hold and you are going to be walking away from this the lies and the deceptiveness you're going to be overcoming this and walking away from the lies and deceptiveness and i see some of you saying jesus how can these people live with themselves and it has to do with the a pisces cancer or a scorpion you're going to be successfully overcoming a deceptive situation with a pisces cancer or a scorpion this man for some of you is a is a cancer this man for some of you is a um pisces okay so whatever is transpiring and acne it could be that you were in a relationship with these people some of you um because the energy of the lovers comes up here especially for the older people so some of you could be uh, married to a taurus virgo or a cap uh, no to um a pisces or a cancer man these two men are so lie and so deceiving so lie and so deceiving and the secret is going to be coming out about a lawyer this lawyer um could be a capricorn lawyer very deceptive very deceptive but it's going to be coming out what she has done and they are going to be finding out what she has done she could lose her licenses to practice lawyer it is a capricorn lawyer a very deceptive person and she's going to lose her licenses to practice law because of something that she does and it's going to come out and i see that you um i see that you virgos are really going to tell what she has done the lies and deceptiveness and something fell out virgos so virgos oh my god all right so i see a cycle has ended for you virgos and it has to do with a deceptive aries or leo lies and deceptiveness of a deceptive aries and leo that is coming out in the first week going in the second week the third week i see money coming in this money um it has to do with someone is paying you to shut your mouth virgos whatever is happening somebody's paying you to shut your mouth someone in power but you're not going to do that you're balancing it out and you're thinking no i'm not keeping your secret because you and and, and it's a secret about a, a lawyer okay so you virgos find out some secret about a lawyer and some money that this lawyer got paid and the lawyer is a virgo okay so you virgos find out something about some lies and secret and uh, with people in power what they have done i see the energy of the enemies and some of you virgos are dealing with a capricorn um or you're finding out that they have done something deceptive by a capricorn and you're trying to heal the situation because is as if someone asks you to do something deceptive by a capricorn and now you're trying to heal the situation and you're thinking i'm not keeping your secrets because if you've done that to her you can done that to me okay so i see you're going to be communicating and speaking up about what people in power has asked you to do and and i see you are really taking down some lies and deceptiveness that has transpired with people in power and i see i'm not I see you standing there and looking at everyone and thinking no i'm not keeping any one of your secrets because you all lie about uh, someone else and you want me to now keep the secret and pay me i don't want dirty money i don't want it okay and it has to do with uh, a um this has to do with uh, a lawyer or it has to do with uh, someone who is older than you who is 45 years and older that is an Aquarian Gemini or Libra and I see you stand up against this person some of you this person could be a brother or a sister of the mother and father brother and sister either one could be your mother or father it could be the 
woman could be the mother or father or the brother but it's a brother and sister and some lies and deceptive but the man I see you Virgos cutting down this man and saying no I'm not keeping the secret is deceptiveness I see you regret a situation and I see you are heartbroken over a situation you regret a situation with a with a Capricorn because whoever this Capricorn is you really care about this person and um, it, it, it could be a Capricorn it's coming up as a Capricorn for some of you I see you regret what has transpired and I see that you're looking at things and if your mom is an Aquarius Gemini or Libran and your father or your uncle or a cousin you're really regretting the situation what has transpired I see justice coming up justice is coming up against some lies and deceptiveness and it has to do with a Gemini justice is coming up with lies and deceptiveness and it has to do with a Gemini I see heartbreaks heartbreaks um, you were all broken about something and you're walking away from this so um, whatever the situation is you're all broken about the situation and you're walking away from it some of you are dealing and you're going to be finding out that justice came up on a man a Pisces or a cancer man a Pisces um, Pisces cancer or scorpion man and an Aries Leo and Sagittarius man justice came up on these two people because of some deceptiveness that they have done and the truth came out because I see some of you Virgo standing up and seeing what exactly has been with a Pisces cancer scorpion man this is coming out as a cancer man and a, a Pisces or a scorpion I see the lies and deceptiveness with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and I see you're stepping away and leaving this person because you found out that they lied. And it's as if for you, they are trying to like uh, um, paying you money to keep your mouth shut. And you said no. You said no. Because you realize that what they have done by this other person is really deceptive. And you thought if they do that by that person, they would do the same by me. And you're like, no, thank you for your ush ush money. I really don't need it what you have done is very deceptive so a lot of lies and deceptiveness that has to do with two older men um, and the the, the the water sign man is a cancer man and the, an Aries Leo Sagittarius a lot of lies and deceptiveness that has transpired and you Virgos are like no I don't want your dirty money because if you do it to that person you can do it to me there we go I see a block is coming up on a deceptive situation that has to do with an a Leo and a Aquarians a Leo and Aquarians I see you speaking the truth about this Leo and this Aquarians the lies and deceptiveness I see some emotional situations some of you are either dealing with your mom or your partner that is an Aquarius Gemini or Libra some real deceptive situation that I see you're dealing with I see you're emotionally you're changing your emotion about a Taurus a, a Capricorn person because you realize the lies and deceptiveness that they have created against this person so whatever the issue is I see you're balancing a balancing you're really balancing out situations some of you it could have to do with your materialistic world that I see some jealousy lies and deceptiveness and you are going to be finding out that you really have some really deceptive people around you I see issues and situation with money inheritance if it's not inheritance it's money property and places and I see the truth is coming out because justice is coming down success over a deceptive situation with a cancer whoever this cancer and this uh, there was some deceptive situation with a cancer people try to steal um your air furnace uh people try to steal what your parents had left you behind and i see you stand up to this i see there is conflicts between a pisces cancer um pisces cancer aries man Whoever these people are, the lies and deceptiveness is coming out. 
I see some of you are really um, connecting with a Taurus, a, a Capricorn, and uh, whatever that was transpiring, I'm seeing that you're realizing and you're finding out the lies and deceptiveness that was going on. And you're like, I really, I, you know, this year is a new year. I don't want to deal with this. I really don't want to deal with this. So you, you Virgos are like, just leave me alone in peace. You all have lied. You all have, you know, um, play the devil's of a card against someone who has never um, misused their powers. And you all misuse your powers over this person. And it's like the Virgo is kind of Jesus. You people are really sick. I just need to get away from this. And I see you're going to be se separating yourself. So if you were um, connected with an Aquarius, Gemini or Libra, I see you're ending this. It could be a parent or a father because both of them are in reverse. So you're like, oh my God, now I'm really seeing you guys. And for some of you, if your mom is an Aquarian, you're going to be saying Jesus or Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. You're going to say, you know, I, I really see you now in a different light. Why would you do that? You know, he or she has never done anything to you. Why would you do that? So there's a lot of secrets is coming out and you Virgos are really just standing behind whatever your heartbreak was over an issue and a situation. I see you Virgos just walking away from it and you're going to be healing from this heartbreak from whatever the issue or situation because it has to do with family. It has to do with legal issue. I see some of you, someone in power paid you to do something and now you're giving up the person and said, oh my God, you could have done this to me too. So it's like, you're like, I don't want your dirty um, money. Wow. Autumn, abundancy, preparation on harvest. So mm, mm, mm. It's, it's, it's like you Virgos, like Jesus, uh, what's wrong with these people? Oh my God, if I'd known it, I would have never had, you know, gotten in contact with these people because you realize that um, there were people who used their power in the wrong way. Okay, so look at today as the beginning of a new positive you and let go of the past. And this is exactly what is coming up. Um, whatever Esther inspire Virgos and they're saying, take another. Um, message for you virgos and it's uh, wow the fire opal sensitivity and confidence and what is transpiring is that look at today virgos as the beginning of a new positive view and let go of the past because you realize what has played the lies and the deceptiveness that people are and how people are and i see um, you have, you're having, some of you are having conflicts with family members because you realize all oh, family members are, um, and, uh, it's really like, Jesus, I can't believe that you guys did this. Why you guys did this? You know what did he or she does? So, and whoever they did, the situation is the tool. You care deeply about this person. And it's as if they didn't want you to be with this person. They didn't want you to have your happiness with this person and they have done this person some injustice and this is all is going to be coming out. So look at this month as a new start. Namaste until next time.